Yo, boys. So this video, we're getting into all of my top three favorite gods in each role in Conquest. And uh, we're just going to get straight into it. I got one game for each role. It's not me talking over. And uh, I'll be playing one game of solo, support, ADC, jungle, and mid. Uh, talking over what my favorite roles are, what my favorite gods for those roles are. And... Um, even build paths that you can do with said gods. And hopefully you guys enjoy the games and like this style of content. And uh peace. I am but now we're actually here with an air or with an Agni game, which again. I said this before, and I'll say it again. Josh, thank you so much for the prime. Agni and Thoth, number one and number two. Number three and number four, uh, Merlin and Zeus. In terms of my mid laners, I don't know like where Agni and Thoth land together. It's probably Thoth number one, Agni number two, but it's by like the smallest portions. And then number three is probably Merlin, and then number four is Zeus. Thoth is S tier, Agni is A tier. I mean, Thoth is definitely easier to play, but I feel like Agni is better overall. Thoth is just kind of brain dead, which is why he's considered better. But if you have actual talent, I think Agni can do just as good. But I could be capping. But from my from my point of view, like when I actually play the game, like a, a video game player, um, Agni goes so hard. Also, like Fenrir is a really common uh, jungler or even solo laner right now. Sick. And uh, and Fenrir shits on Thoth. Yes. I think they're both really, really good, to be honest with you. So I don't think there's any issue. Yeah, Out of five games I played Agni mid, this split, I have a 100% win rate. Yeah, Agni is really good. Agni's really good. Like I said, I think Agni, Agni and Thoth both are like number one and number two. I think they're pretty, um, I think they're pretty even. And then after number one and number two being pretty even, I think it's Merlin Zeus. Zeus goes fourth and over Merlin or under Merlin because I, I am scared. <laughs> the bro watch poor Sam. What? Ben gets destroyed by Agni. That's what I'm saying. That's why I think Agni is better than Thoth. Because Fenrir shits on Thoth, but Agni shits on Fenrir. Oh, you're responding to chat. Okay, I understand. By the way, uh, Plowski in the uh, in the corner over there, and you see the Twitch chat. Plowski's who I'm queued with. He's my Susano. He's my Susano. <laughs> my little dash going are oh, you actually inting by auto attacking like that i'm just saying get the last hit get the last hit get the last hit nice there you go you didn't pick up speed but i guess you don't really need speed my passive's on it so i don't need to stay there that buff will die really quick um, I'm fighting probably AMC mid. Yep. Blue stone. Alright. I did just get very hurt, but that's okay. Oh, he went straight. He went straight for the gank, dude. That's, that's kind of crazy. I respect that, but it is kind of crazy. Um. Your middle tower is under attack. Damn. I mean, that's good though. We got his beads. I will definitely take that.
All right, so we're a little bit ahead. Not by much, but a little bit. I really just want to go... I want to make sure he's getting the losses, by the way, because he has uh, Boombas, and those losses are super important for him. Now, this guy is playing Fenrir, so he does a lot of early game damage, so I need to be careful about that. But I'm kind of okay with it. Unlucky. Oh! The counter gank, though. Is this up? That is not up. Award there. Okay. Enemy spotted. Um. I don't know where the AMC is. Oh, there he is. I do hit five off this wave. If I go crazy aggro, I could maybe kill. But I guess no point. I'm just gonna go to the go to the buffs. I'm just hyper farming right now. As is what everyone does. I want to stun them so I don't take big dicks. I do not like taking big dicks from my buffs. Um, he is going transcendence for a item. I feel like that's not good. Oh, I actually kind of stink. I'm level six. Does he get six off those minions? Because if not, I'm ahead of him. He does. Okay. Nice. Job, buddy. nice. He's probably backing now. I have a lot of uh I have a lot of gold, but my goal right now is literally just farming. I'll back when I can get fin a full finished item. Until then, I don't care about backing. Okay, I'm coming. Yeah, okay. Uh, you baited me. You baited me. I think I'm going to go double flat pen here. Um, I think I'm going to go double flat pen. I'm going to go... There's a fender right here. Gaze upon the might that is certain. Cancel that. Tim hates Doom Orb confirmed. I mean, Doom Orb is just not as good, I think. I think, like, going, going Deso, um... What's it called? Deso Divine is really, really underrated. I think it's so much fucking base pen, it's crazy. Okay, I hate it when my minions get all fucked up. Because Guardian. Or like, not, not specifically Guardian, but like anyone. Uh, all three ults. Good try. Ooh, attack. His ultimate is down. Attack him. Oh, 
Um. Can I get this? Oh, I need the shield. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Not a problem. You honor us with your bravery. All right. Yeah, that's how divine coin goes crazy. That's how divine coin gives you so much base pen. Like right now, I have. I have 20 base pen, which is crazy. And then in the coin gives you percentage pen. And like a bunch of power, obviously. You're just doing so much. On my way. Oh, he's running. I don't know about fighting this, to be honest. I'm a little scared. I'm no longer a little scared. Okay. Not a problem. Oh my god. I did not think they were that close to me. Holy shit! That kind of scared me. You don't like deal more for the same flat pen, but high power. No, because Deso gives you the cooldowns and Divine gives you anti heal. Like it gives you very, like really, really good stats for the future, like for the long game. Whereas like Doom Orb is good with the movement speed it gives you, but it's not as effective. I feel like I never feel like the movement speed saves my life or like helps me get kills, which is probably like, my apologies. it's probably like capping a little bit, but I also don't like the start that it gives you because you have to start tier one. And then tier two is so expensive. Like, it's just a much more expensive item, which is worth noting, you know? I get 100% get owned here, by the way. Deso and Divine are both really cheap items. All right. Um, I guess I'll get this wave before I back. My farming is really good, though. This guy wants to burn my beads. Good damage on him. We probably could have fought that, to be honest. I wouldn't mind fighting this. Oh, never mind. There's a Fenrir somewhere. There's a Fenrir. So, Deso Divine Coin Rod Reaver. Yeah, that build goes so hard. Deso Divine Coin Rod Reaver is so much fucking damage. You can even go Deso Divine uh coin mirrodin reaver and just skip rod be careful an enemy has returned what the hell there's a, there's so many good builds you can do with it you've been doing your own build conduit book of thoth tablet into sorver i play tiamat yeah well you go book of you go thoth and tablet if you're playing either merlin or tiamat obviously because they both spam shit but like um but yeah. There's a lot of good builds for mage or for mid right now. Which is super good because like normally mages get kind of shafted. Thanks. Great work. But right now, like the build, like almost every build, it's hard to build a bad build as a mage right now. You do so much damage by default as a mage right now that it's hard to have a bad build. Oh, coming. Nice. 
nice. Oh, dude, you've just been fucking owned. My goodness. They're all there. Careful, right. On my way. Be careful, right. We take the battle to them. Okay. Oh, you betcha. We definitely want that. Get on this. Be careful, be right. careful, right? Retreat. It's a trap. It's a trap. Oh, too bad, eh? Auto nice. Oh, I stink. Uh, I guess I just go grab tier 2 coin. I could go Mirrodin right now, actually. I could grab tier 2 Mirrodin. But it's time for a percent pen. I wonder, you know, because I'll have coin with percent pen and I'll have decent base pen. I wonder if it's worth it for me to just go like... Instead of um, instead of coin rod, what if I go coin reaver rod? Last item. Oh. I guess I'll come help you out. I think I should probably go Coin Reaver here. I feel like Coin Reaver might be more burst. Oh, I'm fucking dead. Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm just gonna back out here because I got coin. I'm gonna grab some wards. Um Turner's still alive, but probably gonna die. Be careful, left. Left left. Okay. Come Coming. Enemy ultimate down. I see you. That is kind of unfortunate. Wait, did he just age us? I think he just ages. All 
All right. A very nerve, very nervy. Your middle tower is under attack. Hmm. I'm doing okay though. I'm doing okay. I got three stacks on my uh on my Charons, which is very, very big for us. Yeah, I'm just gonna go Reaver. Go Reaver, grab some wards. I think they might be doing gold. On my way. On my way. Attack middle Oh man. I don't think we should have given this up. That would have gotten a tier two and left. That would have been so worth like committing to, to be honest. Enemies incoming left. Retreat left lane. Um I could come kill this Bologna. Enemies in left lane on my way. Okay. I'm just going to save my Aegis. The result, horrific. Go alt. Um. Oh, you're getting fucking owned, gamer. Oh, you should not have held your alt that long at all, Geb. Um, it doesn't help that Charon's like really not playing the game. Like Soul is rotating and like in fights and shit and care. Like even though even though Chiron's winning lane and he's higher level and everything like that, Soul is still out rotating him, which should literally never happen. Should literally never happen. Are you talking to yourself or us? I, I'm talking to everyone. People are scared to ult just one person. I don't think you should ever be scared to use an alt because first off, cooldowns are like very short in smite. And secondly, uh, that alt would have saved the life of somebody, which is super worth it. Bitch! Like, why is he taking my red? Because Surter's AFK, man, he's just pushing. Oh man. Okay. Aries all down. Can you fucking help me, gamers? I'm dealing damage. Massive ult. Holy. I just did like 17,000 damage. I've got your back. Gotta get it back. Actually, I'm 300 gold off starter, which would be massive for me to grab. If I can grab starter, I think. Like, do I I go timeless, right? Or do I go pendulum? Uh, Plowski, I don't know if you can hear me, but if you can, do you know which one I should go? Timeless or pend? I think I go timeless against this team because Fenrir dive, Bologna dive. I'm going to go timeline.
Um. Oh, oh I'm fucking dead. Help me, help me, help me, help me, help me. Oh my god. Oh! Let's go! Holy! Holy! That's the timeline difference! I got fucking kit dumped by 17 humans. And I won the game off of it. Oh my god, that was sick. Whatever, I'm just gonna fucking pull it. We let him teleport because he was dead. We could have we could have very easily stopped his teleport, but letting him teleport kills him. Alright. Is Surtur a bot? Uh maybe. Maybe. The Surtur literally is just running left lane and dying on cooldown. He has fucking Equinox and Yon's Vigor and then like one random ass Oni Hunters. Uh, he might actually be a bot. Seventeen hundred MMR, seventeen hundred everyone on the team is seventeen hundred MMR except for me and Plowski. You should have shielded yourself if you're tanking, but it's okay. He's just not even playing the game, dude. The Surtur just straight up isn't playing the video game. Attack the fire giant. Follow me. Okay. I want to look for a pick. Whatever. I don't know. I don't know. You need a Brian, you mean? Your middle tower is under attack. Attack the fire giant. Boom, baby. <laughs> 
Nice. Nice. No, he just idiot. I don't care. Or is this sort of roasting somebody? There's no way. 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 There's no, way. There's no conceivable way. Okay, I'm dead. Oh, Chiron, you're a fucking legend. You'll make me so horny. Hell yeah. That was sick. All right. I got Rod now. Oh, I thought Rod was 1400. Fuck, now I have to sit here like a, like a doofus. Now I have to sit here like an actual doofus. I wish I could get a ward for fire, but it's fine. Surter is literally one in 10. I feel like I'm pumping some nasty numbies though. Yes. And now that I have rod and I have my timeline up and I have my relics up, I this is going to be a good, 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 Um enemy spot. Nice. Nice. Alright, we're kind of voting. Dead. Let's go. Alright, GG. Why are you kiting it, man? Stop moving it around, please. Please stop. <laughs> All right. Great sin we have committed. <laughs> Giving Surter MMR. Bro, I just pumped, by the way. I'm pretty sure I just did 94,000 damage in like 0.849 milliseconds. Specifically 0.849 milliseconds, which is insane. Let's go, dude. Yeah, it's insane. It's awesome. Okay, um, I... So here's here's what I think about Nemesis. Because my opinion about Nemesis is kind of hit or miss, and people oftentimes don't agree with me. But here, here's what I'm going to say. Uh, I think Nemesis is one of the best junglers in any meta. And let me explain my reasoning. I know she doesn't have a CC immune alt, which is kind of big for like junglers. Like you kind of want a CC immune alt, but, but the reason I think that she's so good is because no matter what the meta is, whether it's ability based assassins, whether it's auto attack assassins, whether it's a, like a blink meta or a defensive meta with beads Aegis, any meta that she is in, she has a place. You know what I mean? Like she's always, she can always sit inside the pocket of the meta. Like, right now, I, I think that ability base is definitely by far, like, the best. I'm going to be going Jotun's. Thank you, baby. We're going to be going Jotun's, uh, Transcendence. I'm going to be going probably Hydra's Heartseeker. Um, she does have a high skill. She has a high skill ceiling. I don't think she has a high skill floor. You know, it's very easy to just go up and press buttons. You know, like alt and then two and then one and that's it. Uh, but she has a very high skill ceiling with the auto attack resets on the three. And making sure that you're alting the tanks in order to get the defenses. Or, you know, if you think the slow will actually matter, you can alt whoever. But, um, you know, she's got a very high skill ceiling. I am getting my lasties. Nice. Um, and, and the other two, like, obviously top junglers are going to be Thor and Thanatos. 
Thanatos Jungle, Nami, thank you for the $10. <laughs> thank Tommy you. JG, please. Yeah, so I think Nemesis, Thor, and Thanatos are probably the best junglers in the game. Um, no, Thor and Thanatos both have semi-globals, and Nemesis just fits in the pocket of whatever meta you want to do. Which I think is is rare and also very good. Get away from me, freak. Um, there he is. He went the long way. He touched me inappropriately. Oh. Oh. Hold on. Wait, I got this. It's too easy. It's too easy. Um, I don't want to tank this, but I will. Oh, I really wanted the last hits there. That's okay, but it is disappointing. Nice, dude. The, uh... Oh, shit. He wants to fight. That's really good. This is really good for me. Nice. Great job, Plowski. Great job, Plowski. And I hit the uh, I hit the dash and the double hit on the two. So good for me. So good for me. I'm gonna let my golden shard clean up the the little boys. All right. Yeah, that is set to was really it was golden. Golden. Yes. Yeah, I'm going to go do the uh the blue one. Going to go do the blue thing first and then after doing the blue totem. Um I think he needs help. This guy does. Cuz he's practically deceased. I don't think he could do this on his own. Right, he's going to pull red down to speed because he's got ranged autos and it's easier for him to do than it is for me to do. I'm going to group him up. Now we get some cooldown. I'm going to back right now before I go do my second speed because it, le it leads me into a nice rotation into duo lane. Um, The other jungler is level 5. He's at 2,700 gold. I'm at 3,200 gold, so I'm feeling pretty good. What do we feel about Susan? I think Susan is pretty good. Um, but Susan is one of those gods that, like, is really, 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 really bad if you're not good with him. You know? You have to be a good Susano player in order to make Susano work. You can't just play him, you know what I mean? I'm assuming they got wards, which is why they're running away. Um, I guess I'll just go for this. All right. I don't, I think this might be a treasure chest actually. It's not unlucky. I can absolutely kill the Kukulin. Well, he's not even here. Back. All right. All right. That's fine. I'll just get the little thingy for you, and then I'll I'll be on my way. Wait! Don't run. Ugh. Nice. Oh, dude, I could so kill this Kukulin. What's his build? 
Dude, he's just blue stone soul eater. Attack left lane. Attack left lane. Enemy is sealed. Nice. Nice. I got you, buddy. Nice. You see what I did there? So what I did there was he was getting ulted. And if the ult didn't kill him, I didn't want him to be next to him. Like next to him so it would, he could follow up on that. So I stood in front of that last shot from his ult. So that he would teleport back to me. At the end of his, uh, his whole ult combo. That's so good, dude. Right, I'm just trying to get some healing. Oh. Gab just got owned. Alright, though. I'm healing off of the... Uh, off the Boombas right now, and then I'm going to go gank right... Okay. He jumped away. Oh, okay, I'm dead, I guess. Okay. Oh. Oh. Alright. Alright. I mean, we got a set alt. They can't do an objective, right? Surely. There's no, there's no reason for me to go over right lane. I can't get there in time anyways, so I'm just going to go farm. Uh, Geb went a little bit too hard. Assets are really low. Probably dead to you, Huang. Although, Oi is coming over there. Um, They stopped gold and nobody died. That's actually really good. Um, I will attack left lane. Left lane. Enemy ultimate down. Enemy spotted. Enemy spotted. Be careful in the jungle. Okay. Oh man. I'm definitely just dead here. I don't know. I said I called out Shiva because I needed Shiva to do something to help me peel away. But it's ultimately that's my fault. I blinked in to try to steal it. And then they just fucking owned me. All right. Um, well, that was definitely my fault. Nothing I can do. I needed the totem. Okay. All right. I think what I'm going to do... What I'm going to have to do now, because my duo lane is losing, my Geb is kind of feeding his brains out. Um, what I'm going to have to do is just uber farm. Oh, Shiva ult down. Not Shiva ult, fucking Yuong ult. Alright. Well, he's gonna do the, the yellow totem, so I'm just gonna back. I'm very far behind. Um. 
Actually, in terms of gold, I'm ahead. Which I don't really understand, but in terms of XP, I'm behind. I don't know why she was in right lane. Uh, they are so deceased. That's really good for me. Um, Alright, that's actually really good. I killed Nut who was on a killing spree. I am now dead though, because this guy is full fucking damn. That guy really, really, really hurts me. Ouch. I'm just gonna have to heal. I'm gonna have to Boombas this bitch. All right. Unlucky, but all right. Oh, I might be dead here. No, I'm fine. We cannot help that. We can't walk into them because we're doing buffs, you know? We'll just get owned. All right. I'm really just trying to catch up in XP with the uh, Tsukiyomi. Where's the... I'm just going to solo this. Because I have no idea where the Tsukiyomi is. And I have I no idea where anyone is really, but... If they come over here, I'll give it to them. I don't really care. But if it's free, it's free. You know what I mean? Fuck it. The Shiva just lost... I'm pretty sure Shiva just lost um, his tower because he was rotating for like 19 minutes. It's alright though. It's alright though. It's alright though. Let's see. I don't know how the Tsukiyumi is keeping up with, with XP so good. Oh, good ages. Alright. I mean, I got the blue. That's pretty nice. I'm doing his blue because I don't want the uh, the nut to do it. I'm on my way. Oh god, you cannot defend that. A set's gonna get altered by a Sukiyomi and just get owned. Although, oh, oh, horny mama, what? All right, I stand corrected. This guy has sex. Holy.
All right, everything's down. I was hoping to get some invade off, but that's fine. Go blue. Or uh, I said blue, but I meant beads. Um, I'm serrated now, so my damage is nuts. Um, I really want to make sure that I can get these oracles because I like having vision of gold. Or at the very the very least securing one of them so they don't have vision of gold. I am here though. I'll attack. I'll attack right lane. Oh, that is criminal. I have missed alt. There he is. Really good damage there. Yeah, that's okay. This guy's still full damage, right? Ow! Okay, yes he is. Jesus. You can, uh, you can wait another, like, 10 minutes, maybe, for this game to end, and then I'll eat it with before I queue again. What, baby? Yeah. The what today? Yeah, I will. But I am here. Ow, that motherfucker hurts, dude. surprised we were able to get that actually uh, my next item I'm thinking it's gonna be a heart seeker because I don't have a lot of damage yet I like, get a decent amount I'm definitely like pumping numbies it's just not as many numbies as I'd like to be pumping At least I'm even in uh, XP now. Oh, hello. Nice. That's a really good Gebalt. Now, I know I know people have, like, issues with single... Single man ulting, but I think single man ulting for a kill is so smart. Alright. Okay, that's, that's both relics. Both nut relics. Heart seeker. Good stuff. Good stuff, Shiva. The cuckoo should have erosion. Yeah, one of them definitely should get erosion because we have uh, Geb, Nem, and a set shield. Um
Dude. I tried beading the Sobek pluck and I couldn't get it off. That is so cringe. So a uh, cringical. Literally completely my fault. I honestly should have just altered the Sobek for tankiness and I would have been fine. Oh, wow. I kind of want to go trans. I, I kind of feel like I could do enough damage to make trans worth it. Like if I go trans, if I go trans heart seeker, what's my percent pen? It's 40% pen. It's actually worth it. I think I, I think I'm going to do it. And the reason going translate works is because, uh, because trans is based off damage or stacking in general is based off the damage you deal now. So you can build it literally whatever. We could just do pyro. Shiva is running it down. This should be completely free because of a set alt. A set alt bursts like 2,000 damage and they can't walk into it. Or they take 2,000 damage, so... The nut just all. I'm gonna stand in, stand in this for a second. If I have to blink to go help someone, I will. But I don't know. I don't know why she was in there, dude. Yeah. While they're chasing Gab, we're just gonna do all the objectives on the map. I think. I mean, yeah, he dies, but like, it's pretty worth it. Oh, unless you die too. Oh, man. See, now... Now they might be able to do fire. Let's go! I got it! I got it! Holy! Holy! Let's go, dude. Okay. Nice. That probably just saved the game because we were going to get owned. We were going to lose the game. Because our tanks W keyed at them. Um, I do want Heartseeker now. I can't afford it, so I guess I'll just go. Okay, okay. Go Boomba Spear. And this. Please. I don't know who was alive. I don't know who was alive when I got fire. Quiet, 
Yeah, I want to go Boomba's Hammer, not Spear. Sorry. Boomba's Spear would waste 10% pen. So I'm going, I'm going Hammer. Also, I'm utilizing Hydras. Um, and utilizing Hydras is, is really good for... Like, Boomba's Hammer is really good for utilizing Hydras because you just get the, the Omega heals, you know? He just jumped in. He could definitely die here. Nice. Um Okay, I got a good healing there actually. Oh man. He's a just not The bees are just nut. Oh, what? Oh. Wait, we're 27 minutes into the game, and the Geb that first item bought prophetic isn't even stacked yet. That is pretty spooky. Honestly, this Hydra's would own. What's their top damage? Tsukiyomi. I love if we can get that beacon. We should just run it up mid, to be honest. Retreat middle lane. Yes. Attack middle tower. Attack middle tower. Retreat. Retreat. I don't know why I'm being pinged to retreat. Not all. You hung off. We should definitely attack left Phoenix. I knew in order to live, I would have to, uh, in order to live, I'd have to beads. Mm. Yeah, I need to get this. Um, I kind of want, I kind of want my fire blink, but I don't know. You found a, a 74 year old penny. That's probably worth more than a penny. All right. Um, they're just base defending. I also, I shouldn't really be in there. I should be kind of like defending. 
making sure they cannot get close. I'm dead. Nice. Okay. Oh my god. But I think we just lost the game. If any, if they die, we lose the game. Oh, that, that guy might die. Nice! He died! Wait, that guy went way too aggro and killed himself. Alright. Now, us dying, by the way, for EFG is, is actually worth it because we have EFG on not only our hunter, which is super important because that means he can just walk in and hit an objective, but he, we also have EFG on the mage, which means he has more sustain and he can actually live, which is big. Now, EFG on an assassin is good because it means I can 1v1 whoever I damn well please, but um, it doesn't really matter, I think, as long as we have EFG on a few. I wish the Hoi didn't kill himself, though. Does he have no healing? Wait, what the hell? He has Jotun's? Jotun's Crusher? He's ability-based Hoi? I just realized he's Bluestone Jotun's uh, Transcendence Crusher. What in the world? All right, I'm coming, buddy. Enemy missing. On my way. Be careful. Enemies in right lane. Enemies in left lane. Attack. Yes. All right, we got fire onis in mid and in left. They're gonna own those phoenixes. Nice. Nice. Um, I really want to get this mid phoenix. I would also really like to get this left Phoenix. I gotta wait for the boys to spot up though. Nice. Um, I don't think we can end. I think we retreat. dead you didn't have anything up unlucky did I not pick up that red all right on a 3k pot I guess Hoi will take it. Um. All right. I still had speed on. All right. No big deal. We're doing pretty good here, I think. Actually, I want to get a ward. Because it looks like we're going to have to do fire one more time. before they even sprout. Is 
There's no way he went one more wave up. Oh, he did. Definitely did not need to do that. Nice. Wait, why am I taking? I literally saw the Gab auto it. All right, well, that should be game over. I, I'm pretty sure that's game over because we picked the Tsukuyomi and then we... Yeah, because the set is ult too. I'm going to ult him just on Tanky. It is a very good thing that I ulted him because I was getting owned. Nice. GG, dude. And that's why Nemesis is good in jungle. I feel like you can just do whatever. And I was also so tanky. Like, I, I tanked so much damage when I, uh... When I ulted that... That... Kukulin at the end there. I wish I could go back and screenshot it. And see how much it was. But I, I don't know. Maybe I'm just insane. Maybe I'm insane all mode. Oh yeah. Cool. Cool beans. Okay, we're gonna try Hachi again. I know it didn't work earlier when we were trying to record duel, but we're gonna try to play it in conquest now. Again, I've said this before, I'll say it again. My top three hunters in conquest are Hachi on her Ishtar. I think they're insanely good. Um I wanna go the crit build. I want to go the crit build. What's the crit build though? <laughs> Does anyone know? <laughs> it's um It's uh Dest is it Dest Toll? No, it's gilded, probably. If I had to guess it's gilded into Devos. Um It's Arrow Devos. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much for saying that. So, Gilded Arrow, Devos, into... It's probably, like, just Xe Rage. It's probably just into Xe Rage. Uh, maybe it's not Rage. No, it's got to be Rage first. If you're building Rage, you build it first. Uh... It's just Rage Demon Blade Deathbringer, right? Yeah, Rage Demon Deathbringer. Okay. Arrow Devos Xe Rage Dom Deathbringer. Dom, not not Demon Blade. Do Dom for the pen instead. Why are you bringing it this way? Yeah, walk it, walk it, walk it, walk it, walk it. Yeah, Dom for Pen's not bad. Man, Nuts got the early pressure though, baby. She's pressuring. Okay, I'm pretty sure I just I just owned that nut.
I guess I'm not doing that much damage, but like I'm kind of I'm kind of holding my own. My damage isn't crazy, but neither is his. Oh. I respect this Ymir for going for the freezes. Nice. Come on, give me my three. Give me my three. We fight this. Oh, but I wanted that kill, man. I wanted that kill, man. All right, there is a nemesis over there. I've just witnessed. Okay, I didn't want to pick that up. I just wanted to run away, but it's fine. Wait, he didn't pick this up. What the heck? I thought supports always get the first, uh, the first arrow thing, right? Or am I crazy? I've always given my first arrow shield or my first shield to the supports. Dude, I am, I am damaging. She's stuck. Okay, I think you might be dead. Uh, I'm running away. I'm running away, and I hope that you don't feel some sort of way about it, because I will die if I don't. You gotta back it up, gamer. You're gonna get assassinated. All right, not bad, not bad. I'm assuming they got the shield buff. They didn't get the shield buff. Do I get owned if I go for that? I, I definitely get owned if I go for that. That's a great way to instantly lose all of your lead. I'm fucking doing it. Lovely. All right. I can't get Devos. One more wave. I'll greet a wave. I'm going to run this way, though, because I will get owned. No, Ymir. Ymir, don't do it, buddy. He's going for the nut. Oh, she ran. I think she just blinked over a wall. Oh, but Loki's here. Loki alt. Nut beads. I mean... Will she die to my alt? No! Oh, he missed! My two hit her, by the way. My two hit her, but she lived. That's crazy. Okay, Raw, don't kill me. Nemesis, don't kill me. Everyone, let's just chill. Let's just chill. Let's relax. Take a couple of breathers. Dude, I can't... I can't believe that two didn't kill her. I want to message him. His name is Thrustin Bieber. <laughs> I want to message Thrustin Bieber and see how low HP he was. That's crazy that he that he didn't die. Do 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 do.
Nice. Neath wants to attack right. I like Neath mid. What I don't like about Neath mid is that I don't have a mage. I mean, it's kind of okay because we have two damage dealing guardians. So, like, I like having a mid mage or a, a mid hunter this game because both of our guardians can deal big damage, like Cthulhu and Ymir. But in normal team comps, if you have like a warrior solo, I hate Neath mid. All right, what's your build? You're just Debbie, you're Debbie'd up. All right, I think we're just chilling, me and him. I think we have like, we have some kind of unspoken agreement that like we can't kill each other right now. Although if anyone was to kill anyone, it would be me killing him. All right, totem me. You got issues, bro. You got issues. Ouch. I'm getting owned. I'm actually not getting owned. I actually really just owned him. They're not saying retreat left lane, are they? Nemesis is coming left lane, though. Yes, I saw. I've witnessed. I missed four autos in a row. That's tragic. Your power is under attack. <laughs> There's Nemesis. There's Bacchus too. I just all out. Nice fucking wall, player! Let's go! That was an insanely good wall. Holy, man. I'm not- I'm not normally impressed by, like, defensive plays. That was a very good play. He ulted to CC immune the uh the slow or like to rid himself of the slow from Nemesis for ult and her too. And then like basically instantly popped it and then walled off all the auto attacks in the universe. That was so good. That's pretty. I'll give my boy uh I'll give my boy some cooldown. I don't even need to back to get XE here. I should probably buy some wards, actually. I'll clear this wave and go buy more wards. Relder, thank you for the tier two. 69 Q Hugh Q. Wow, I am doing damage. Holy crap. There's her beads. Hello. No problemo. We're chilling. Oh. Nice. Not bad. That was a good knee fault. I'll probably just go. I'll probably just go. Uh, Aegis here. I do think Blink's not bad on Hunters. But in this specific case, I will be going Aegis. How has Nut died three times? I know Ymir got the first kill on her. Uh... I guess Loki got the second kill, maybe? And then I just got that one. I'm top damage? Your tower is under 
It is not often you see a hunter as top damage, especially in the early game. some damn here my autos won't go dude i'm pressing the button and they're not shooting gonna invade all right never mind i take it back there's a nemesis here please auto attack please oh my gosh Uh, Nemesis might invade my camps. If she does, it's just kind of something I have to deal with. But we're not really, we don't have any pressure mid, it seems like. Because they keep yelling at this Neath. Though, you know, I've seen, I've seen some Neath alts in my day. And the one that hit the, the nut was not a bad one. I gotta admit. just gonna push wave uh not rotated mid somewhere for some reason but i'm not exactly sure why Could get rage. I mean, they TP'd right, so they can't do gold, right? Like, at least, at the very least, Nemesis and Raw both TP'd, which leaves only Nut because Bacchus is in mid, and Nut definitely can't solo gold. I sent Ymir to right. That's fine. I probably saved his life. Honestly, me dying there. Might have been the best outcome. Because they were ready for the dive. Like, Loki was going in. I was following up. But they were ready for it. Somebody's dying. <coughs> that raw is really big, though. It's kind of scary. This raw keeps ganking. Or the, uh, the Loki keeps ganking left. this is ready. it's not it's just saying staying super safe I saw the nemesis there I probably need to be careful All right. What is my crit chance with just rage? It's not that high. I feel like... Oh, they're just doing pyro? They get pyro for free, huh? That's the problem with... Also, like, with not having a mage, is you don't have a lot of, uh burst damage so like getting those those objectives is really hard to do
We're looking. We're lurking and looking. Okay. Alright. They're gonna be looking at me since I just uh I just showed phase really high up and left, so I'm just gonna instantly run away. But I still have alt and I still have a tower to run to also. <laughs> Their green just spawned, which means their purple is probably spawning really soon. Oh, a Bacchus takes damage. Hello. Okay. Okay. That's weird. I really don't understand that. Okay. Oh. That sucks, man. Nemesis blinked down. Yes, we can. Are they going to gold or are they fighting? I can't tell if they want to fight me or not. Definitely going gold. Okay. Oh, okay. That's fine. They're definitely doing gold, right? Oh, they're, they're, they're not doing gold. Wait, they just wanted to kill me. Wait, so that Yorm teleported to left just to fight me? That's so sweet. That makes me feel so important. I don't know how the heck the nut is level 19, by the way, because I... I've been owning him. I guess I just go Demon Blade here. Um, I guess not has two kills. What's my crit chance now? 55%. That's okay. I don't think Deathbringer will cap it though, will it? You saw someone there? Because I definitely did not. Oh, he's rotating again? All right. He's back again. On my way. Enemy, enemy enemy Damn it. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I almost got the Gold Fury, but I wasn't quite able to get the last hit on it. Your 
Nice. I'm gonna. I'm so dead. By the way, I have to back right now. Please don't. Thank you. All right. Uh, let's get ornate arrow because that's gonna give me crit chance and attack speed for every 100 gold I have, and it gives you more gold in general, which is really nice. Uh. Look, you said I'm AFK till 20. I think that's probably the best play. We're not down that much. We're down 3k at 22 minutes, which realistically, not a big deal. Realistically, not a big deal. What's my crit chance now? 72. That's pretty good. Uh, I can definitely kill the nut really fast. Like, if the nut doesn't expect me somewhere, she can just die. I kind of want to see if I can gank her here. But if Nemesis shows up... Yeah, Nemesis is already here. Level 20 with a 500 pot. Only three items, though. Oh. All right, well, Nemesis is back. I don't know where Nut went, but she definitely went somewhere. Oh, she just ran off. All right. Well, let's see. Yeah. Yeah. Why is not just sitting there? I don't think I showed on the map by using my one there, so they might not know I'm here to push. Alright, so I get tower here for free. And then I probably run this way because I'll die. But I want to be there mid. Back. Okay. Yorm is here. Right Why is Yorm here? Ready, oh no, he's not here. He was faking it. He was faking it. He got me though, I'll be honest. So what I have, I should have like 80% crit chance now? Yeah, 86. Nice. So the more gold I have, the more crit chance I have. I don't think I can solo on Nemesis, can I? Okay. Oh, that's her blink. Okay. Uh, blink beads alt them. That was absolutely everything Nemesis had, which is, I mean, it's fine, I guess. I wish someone would rotate, specifically my Loki, because Nemesis is just camping in left lane, but uh, they're playing in mid. And I guess. My master's border Cthulhu is getting absolutely cock slammed in right lane. He should just be completely. Holy fuck, that did a lot of damage. Was she like 70% health still? And it just like clapped her? Oh my god. What in the world? I know she's got hidden dagger, but like, holy nuclear alt. I think we should, we should just rip fire. 
the big one. Okay, I think this is stupid. This is definitely stupid. We should have just done big fire. Uh, that's for these. Nice. Alright. He's not gonna ult me, right? He's just gonna ult away. Yeah. For sure. We should definitely attack this. I mean, we just can't, we just can't hurt this guy, I guess. We're going to get blinked on again. I'm just going to back. Oh, that was her beads. That was Nemesis beads. I don't know why we didn't, we should have just ripped big fire, but I think my team was scared. They were a little scared. You can't really blame them. I have a hundred percent crit chance now. Uh, I kind of want move speed, but I'm not going to go get it. I'll save that for someone else. Instead, I'll grab this. Thank you. And then I will attack mid lane. Don't let him get it. I'm coming. Oh my damage. Oh my. Holy crap. Five autos for 1400. All right, this is completely free. Completely free. I we just need to defend against Raw. As long as we keep Raw out of the picture, we are chilling. Where is Raw? I don't see him. All right. We'll grab this now. That's going to give me a lot of power. We'll grab a 500 pot. We'll grab a sentry ward. Pretty good. Could have waited for EFG. Yeah. Well, I don't know because if we waited for EFG, then uh, we'd have to team fight. Which I'm not saying we would lose it, but it's riskier. I have six stacks of Deathbringer, which I'm pretty sure gives me 30 power. So I should be, yeah, I am, I am pumping. I am pumping. Oh my God. Oh, he got that shit. That is so rude. Oh my god, man. I do a lot of damage with this crit build. I like it. I like it. I... I... I'm bugged out. I'm bugged out. Hello? Ow. I'm just aging because I don't know if Raw's lining something up. Dude. 
I am roasting and fucking toasting. I am roasting and fucking toasting, my boys. Roasting and fucking toasting. Pow, 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 pow. Wait, I missed all my autos. Wait, I missed all my autos. Wait, I missed like 17 autos at once. I was owning. All right. We got two Phoenixes. We could have won the game if I was better at video games, but, you know, just so happens I'm bad, I guess. Unlucky. My servers have been replaced with hamsters. <laughs> uh, I just realized I don't have any anti heal on my build. If you hit an enemy, you hit them an enemy, they become marked for eight seconds. Uh, if you hit the marked enemy or the marked enemy hits you, you get a stack and one stack is 2% increased damage. That's kind of not worth it. Honestly, I really don't care about the upgrades right now. I'd rather build these. Like, I'd rather upgrade relics and get wards at a 500 pot. Give me some attack speed. Thank you. That's the only issue with this build is attack speed, but the more gold you get, the more attack speed you get too. What is this little ward right here? What is this? Oh. Oh my god, bro. He just got cooked. 1900, 2000 damage plus that quickly. Holy. Actually cooked. I'm going to send the Raven Ward right there because I want to know if anyone's hiding behind the wall. Dude, dude, if they get frozen, they're dead. We should attack the Titan. They're low. They're low HP. Okay. Dude, I just I'm just autoing. I'm just auto attacking. They're all dying. Hello. Okay, just a casual 2,000 damage there too. Look at my damage. 2,100 to Yorm, 2,300 to Nut, 1,700 to Nemesis, and 1,700 to Bacchus. They just walked at me and I owned them all. I just did like 10,000 player damage in the, in the last one minute of that video game. Holy shit. <laughs> Yo, Hachiman is very fun when you're not getting owned by an Erlang Shen. That's for sure. Very fun. I think top three supports. Well, it depends on what rank you are, I feel like, actually. Because if you're like, if you're like bronze, silver, gold, then like Kepri is just people don't play around his his heal, his uh his revive, right? But if you're higher up, then I think counterplay like Charon with the silence or Ganesh with the silence or even Terra with the the like super wide root. I don't know where she is. She's somewhere in here. Oh, there she is. She's banned right now, but um oh, she's not banned. She's picked actually. She's their support. You can't see it, but she's under my face. I'd say top 3 supports for me right now or in the meta right now if you're like kind of a good player probably Ganesh Charon and then it's either Bacchus or Terra Bacchus and Terra can both be annoyingly hard to deal with and can make game winning plays so I, I think it's like either one but I'll say you know just so there is my opinion out there I'll say Ganesh, Karon, Terra. 
And then Bacchus is fourth. If you are bronze, silver, or gold, just pick full crit, merc support, and kill everyone. That's true, actually. I hear pretty often that um, they can't kill your teammates if they're dead. So that does work. Uh, let's go war flag. Probably just this. I don't know if I go horrific. I mean, they have a Terra and a Hercules for healing. So horrific probably goes really hard here. Probably goes really hard here. Uh, and then Thebes. I could go prophetic though, actually, because I could poke really easy. And they have two physical. They have three physical and two mages. Both mages are pretty easy to get with. Um. So I think I'll go prophetic actually. Am I hungry? Uh, not right now. Not yet. Thank you, baby. Yeah, hybrid Terra is also good. I actually really like going second item. Uh, I like going second item Chronos Pendant a lot. We have to look at the frog, by the way. If you don't know, in every single Conquest game, there's a frog. And he hangs out right here. And eventually, he'll turn into a real frog and then he'll leave. A lot of people don't know about the frog. But it's a pretty good frog. It's a pretty good frog. Hello. Oh, Jesus Christ. That is so tragic that he picked that up. Thirty-two. I've been out. Oh, they're gonna have way more pressure than us early. We basically don't get to play the video game. Terra and then AOE auto attacks. They're kind of playing uh, like a cheese, a cheese duo lane, to be honest. I should have got my two, actually. But what I could do with my two is if, uh, if she was trying to detonate... What is it called? If she was trying to detonate the little pillar on the ground, I could have silenced her dash mid-dash. Then it still goes on cooldown. Alright. Link. Sure. Oh yeah, I'll go back to I'm cool with that. Or rank are we in? Uh, 2500 MMR Masters. No problem. I'm coming. Please don't clear yet. Enemies in the right jungle. Enemy All right. Spot. Just get this buff here. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. You know, I also realized not only do they have pressure, like the the Terra, the Terra Heim lane, but. Jingwei also picked up 
attack speed buff. Or Jingwei also picked up green buff instead of attack speed buff early. Okay. Well, they just double ulted you. Both alts. Yes. He has been owned. All right. I just got to chay. Oh, I got to chill out here. Just going to hang out. AFK for a bit. Caught her dash. I didn't catch her dash. Come on, land the auto. There we go, buddy. Nice. Nice. Now we died there, but the Jingwei got two kills, so that's pretty good. I think Sir Cat got. I think Haim and Sir Cat both shared 1 1 for kills right there. My ult did so much damage, by the way. It did 340 to Terra and three or and 200 to Sir Cat. That is so much damage. Oh, did she bees that? I don't think she beats it. Nice. I don't know why he picked Terra into Ganesh, to be honest. <laughs> that is a hard thing to play. I just want Prophetic, by the way. Does he have Prophetic too? No, he's... Hello. I'm okay with taking damage. I'm just getting stackies, you know? My goal is just to stack up. You like prophetic on Ganesh? What about Gab? Uh, I like prophetic on anyone that's easy. I, I like prophetic based on team comps rather than what I'm playing. To be honest with you. Because I think if, the, if it's easy to get stacks, I'm dead here for sure. If it's easy to get stacks based on the team comp you're fighting, then I think it's worth picking up. Nice. Oh, she's. Oh, you kill her there if you land that. That's so in for it. It's so in for it. If he lands that three, he kills him. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Criminal. I sure hope it's not mating season right now. Ugh, this species is wild. Uh. 
I can't do anything there. Yes, we can. Your left tower. Give me XP. XP. Uh, I'll just take, I'll take the yellow portion of it. Got tier two alt, baby. My masters? I am masters, yeah. Hello, I want prophetic. Honk. I missed. Um, I really just want to stack my prophetic. It sucks because, like, it's hard to do, but it is so worth doing. Oh. Hello. Wait, give me another stack. Wait, don't leave yet. Wait, don't leave yet. Wait, don't leave yet. is just whiffing. He's actually just whiffing. Nice. Nice. There we go, baby. There we go, baby. I'll hold that L so my team can flourish. You get cooked for building prophetic on Geb. I don't know, man. I, I feel like Geb's cooldowns are really long and he only has one like reliable source of damage. So I guess it kind of makes sense. But uh, like I have 11 stacks at 11 minutes. That's like pretty decent. One stack a minute. It's not, not terrible because it takes so long to get it online anyways. Oh my God, I kind of want to clear this wave and say, fuck you, Benny. My dude's level 13. I'm sitting in the trenches at 10. Hey, let me poke you. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Thank you. Hey, got him. Got his ass. Got his ass, baby. <coughs> yeah, I think Merlin's extremely good right now. Like, very, very good. Damn, did he get two of those for real? Oh, he horrific. Or horn charted. Enemy missing. Enemy missing left. Not too close. All right. I think we're kind of chilling here. I think we're getting this. Let's go. Oh God. Is she dead? Did she get ulted? She did get ulted. 
Oh, she lived. Let's go. You rock. All right, I got to go get Thieves now. Go get Thieves. And then honestly, I'm just going to go Pridwin here. And I'm going to pop. I'm going to zit all over him, dude. Call me a pit bull. 15 stacks. I really need to hit more physical gods. Like, I need to go help my, my boy Yorm over there. Or punch this Heimdall. Um, I'm not going to take that wave of XP. Because I'm already pretty even. Yeah. Whatever. Oh, I'm just gonna walk through here. That's cool, y'all. Fuck. Oh, I'm in. No, I almost got one. No. I can never kill Heimdall. I don't even know where he went. He just ran. Bro, turn around. All right, that was pretty good. Enemy missing middle. Help left lane on my way. Follow me. You gonna upload to YouTube today? I already did. Nice. Hello. Hello. But I'm getting slaughtered by this fucking thing. Ouch. Oh, what the fuck? He's back. He's back already, man. I went to go help my... My, uh... My Jingwei, who is inting. Oops. Oops. That's good, though. That's 20% cooldown right there. I'm at 30... 30% cooldown? Next item should probably be upgraded. Like, it should be Spartan Flag, right? It, it's Spartan Flag. Is it War Banner, actually? Which one's better? It's War Banner, right? I'm pretty sure it's War Banner. Yeah, I thought it was War Banner, I just didn't know. Okay. On my way. Attack. Attack. I'm actually just trying to peel. I'm literally just sitting here trying to peel. Savor this. Savor 
Nice. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I got on. Oh, oh, nice. Oh, that one almost killed. Okay, I have 25 stacks. So I, I need probably, I just need physical stacks, I assume. I don't know. We we did that whole fight without Jingwei, I think. Jingwei just split pushing. Um, I'm gonna go stone a binding. Oh, I'm also gonna buy some wards. I need oh I need three magical stacks and two physical. That's weird. Because I I was like eleven magical and then five physical and now it's like flip flopped. I've been owning the I've been owning the uh, the mages too much. The the physical gods too much. Yeah, I'll take the cooldown. I sure hope it's not mating season right now. No, this feels so this. Enemy spotted. Um. Oh gosh. Oh. I am very tanky, but I don't know if I'm tanky enough for this. Okay. Right, I'm literally just sitting here trying to keep everyone alive. It's harder than it looks. It's much harder than it looks. I can't reach there. Your middle tower is under attack. Catch the second. Oh, man. Save me this. Ah, uh, bummer. Bummer. That's all right. We got greedy for the kill. And I got. They got greedy for the kill. I got greedy for the stack. But I don't think there's much of a problem with it because I'm literally just inting. Like, I mean, there is a problem with inting, but there's not a problem with inting the way I'm doing it because I'm inting after we're winning team fights and I'm just going for stacks. And then once I finish Prophetic, because I just finished Thieves' last fight, so once I finish Prophetic, I'll be super tanky. With a finished Spartan flag, finish Prophetic and Thieves, I'm like damn near unkillable. I literally just need one mate one mage stack. This is pretty good. Oh, you're so dead. It's always good to be aware of your surroundings in an unfamiliar. That's unfortunate. You won't get paid. Later. Oh, whatever. Prophetic. Let's go, baby. Yeah, I just get to sit here and be super fucking annoying, dude. Mm. 
Okay. Okay. It's not bad. Oh, I didn't see the circuit. I'm gonna die. I'm just trying not to spread the poison. I knew I was dead. I just wanted to not spread the poison so that my team could win the fight after. But that's good though. We should do we should do gold or fire. I mean, probably gold though. Oh my god, those crits. Nice. Do we actually get this Phoenix? We do. Damn. Damn. I have an important question that needs an answer. Okay, hit me with it. If Morgan changes into nut, they both up at the same time on the same person. Is it considered Bukaki? Because nut nutted on nut. I think no. Because Bukakis have so many more people involved. Gimme. Is tank beads like some new meta I missed? No, uh, you can definitely have beads as a tank. I just don't. I don't because I don't need it, you know? Um, They do have a shell. But they don't They don't have a lot of shields. It's just a shell. I mean, she has Pridwin too. Erosion wouldn't be terrible, but I think Stone Binding is better. That's my mantra. Defend! Defend the fire giant! Yes! Okay, they are definitely doing gold. Enemies in the jungle. Be right back. Hell yeah. That's really good. That is really good. Nice. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I didn't know that he could TP while CC'd and silencing is a CC, right? That's probably just GG, right? There's no way. Why, why are you walking the Titan out of my ult, bro? Okay. All right. Oh, jeez. They're being mean. They're being mean, dude. The game was over. The game was already over. And they're just being mean, murdering him in his own fountain. Look, I died a lot, but like, I was in there. And every single time I died, we, we got so much out of it. Like, we won the team fight and then got an objective. Whether it be a tower... Or Bull Demon or Gold Fury or something. I'll take it. That was a that was a pretty good support game. I died a lot, but it was a pretty good support game. Those deaths meant a lot. GG. What up, boys? A Welcome back. We're playing solo lane, Bologna. Uh now there's a couple builds you can do with Bologna, I think. Well. By the way, uh I just want to go ahead and say this. I was between picking Bologna and Osiris, and then Osiris first picked jungle. So like, <laughs> I was like, well, okay, that solved my issue that I was I was having. 
But there's a couple ways to build her. You can build her with the uh, the Death's Toll, aka Death's Embrace, plus um, the Equinox item, which is what I'm going to be doing. Let's do this. Which is super broken. And you can also build her the other way, which is... Hold on, I will show you in a second. Which is the uh, Warrior's Axe into Berserker Shield way. You're pretty much always going to build Equinox, even if you go uh, Warrior's Axe, you're going to be building Equinox. But with Death Toll Equinox, you actually don't go Death Temper. You go Death Embrace. And you build a bunch of HP. So like Death Embrace plus Equinox plus like Berserker Shield. And then you're going to build a bunch of HP of like Shogun's has HP on it. A pretty decent amount. Berserker's, like I said, has 150 on it. Uh, and then you could even go like some bullshit like Mystical Mail if you want. Or I'm pretty sure that Arc Druid has a lot of HP on it. You could go that. You go frostbound, and then uh, you basically just build a bunch of defense and then kins. Death's Embrace, Equinox, a bunch of defense that gives you HP, and then kins. And then you own. You just walk at them, and they die. Or you die. I mean, you know, that's smite technically, I guess. That's a whole thing. Uh, what is this? But yeah. What was the meme item Sam built earlier this week that he lost horribly in duel? Oh my god. You br you bring it up and I instantly get mad. It's called Stormseeker. It's uh it's under the bow branch and it is the worst item in the game. 15 physical power, 20% attack speed. Did you know if you do the math of this stupid ass item that you have to get two you have to land 200 auto attacks to get the same attack speed as this item? 200 auto attacks to save yourself 200 gold. Which, like, let's just be honest. Let's just say it how it is, right? Uh, you're probably not getting 200 auto attacks in a duel game. And you most certainly are not getting 200 auto attacks as an ADC in a Conquest game. Unless you're playing Charybdis, in which case, you know, fair enough. Or the game is 40 minutes. But most games these days end like 25 to 35 minutes. So, I don't know. But you get 15 power. I the dead ah hey man dude that item yeah, I've never been as angry recording a game as I was recording that duel I it just it broke me it actually broke me all right if I'm on a still level one he just hit level two I just hit level two I have death toll so I can gotta be super abusive here and what I mean by that is I'm going to hit the wave a bunch. And then I'm going to hit him to group up the wave. And then I'm going to just just death toll my way to, to victory here. And he has to just kind of deal with it. Now, he did go uh, he did go Warrior's Axe. So he's going to be a, a much, much tankier than I am. But... Okay. I love you. That was great to me. So yeah, he's gonna get that, but I'm just gonna get so much pressure here that it's super okay. I am super okay with this. I'll just hit this a little bit, I guess. Let's see, his pots and my pots are the same, but I'm full health and he's not even close. Oops. Oops. Nice. If I'm not autoing him, I have so much pressure over him. Then even when I do auto him, like... I just hit this guy for 70 damage. Also, we're both going Equinox because we're not stupid. Uh, let's see. Are you building that? Oh, you are over there. Hold on. Oh, yo, if I got that. If I got that. All right. So if Vamana ever ults me, by the way, I'm going to max my three when I get Equinox. If Vamana ever ults me, uh, I simply press three with Equinox and I out heal him with Equinox plus Death's Embrace or just Death's Toll in general. It's not Death's, Death's Embrace for a long time.
poop. Bok is singing all attack, bro. Nice. Hello. 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 Bro, I get to actually just so chill here. I wonder if he thinks I was going to steal his buff because of the pressure I have here. It honestly wouldn't be insane to, to assume that. But that's why he like kind of fucked off for a second. Oh, and I get attack speed. I get attack speed totem too. Bro. It is, it is Juice City right now. I am in Juice City right now. Holy. No reason to hold back. I can TP in with literally no potions and just demolish him. Boop. Oh, yeah? You want to do that? You doing that one? What if I just what if I just followed you around? What if I just followed you around. Would that be okay with you? Seems like you're a little upset by it. Dude, is this not stupid? And it only gets better, by the way. It only gets better. I thought you had to hit the totem before picking up the buff. Uh the first totem that spawns on any buff is uh is free to pick up. Well, that is tragic. BBD. Dude, he was almost dead. He was almost so dead. Oh my god. And then I have no potions, but I'm just sitting here healing up. I'm just sitting here healing up so much. I took... I, I mean, it doesn't really show, but I probably took so much damage from that tower. My next item is obviously going to be a Berserker Shield. I could make it a lot of different things, but Berserker Shield just makes the most sense to me right now. Uh, I will be invading. I will be invading. He has Equinox now, which is pretty good. That's pretty good. I have no idea where he is. Oh, I guess he, he thought that I was going to invade him again. So I went to go defend. Oh, uh, Susano is here. He is here. I'm gonna go this way. I could definitely get yoinked here. I'm just gonna be very careful, even though I don't see the Susano. I'm just gonna be super careful in three for the secure. Uh, in terms of gold, I am pretty significantly ahead. Does he just clear that wave and I'm still ahead of him? Like, how do you fight that, bro? Like, he has Equinox too. But he doesn't have auto, uh, auto attack enhancers like I do. What do I think of Vital Amplifier on Bologna? It's not that good because it only procs, it only procs every third auto attack on your three, and even at max attack speed, it's not that quick. That is unlucky. I'm just gonna ult him. I'm just going to ult him. Nothing really comes from it, but... Just because. Why not? And he's going to TP back. There we go. He gets tier 1 Berserkers. That is definitely not happy. That is not happy dances right there. Like, look at this burst, man. 
I don't even care. I don't even care. Any damage he deals just doesn't matter to me. Because, like, genuinely, what is he going to do to me? I'm just Bologna. Like, at the end of the day, I'm just Bologna. I cannot take that. Nice. Nice. And now I got Berserker Shield for free. A little Berserker Shield for free. Teleport in there. Grab a couple wards just in case. I honestly, I'm warding for their defense. Like for their safety. Because they are literally never, ever, 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 ever going to kill me. Also, because Vermont is dead and he's got no TP, this should be free. Uh, I believe you're dead. I stink. Never mind. BBD. Alright. He could have been dead if I was, like, better at the video game. But that's okay. Is Phalanx not good? Phalanx is good. But you don't get the permanent attack speed from Phalanx. It's, uh, you get attack speed under... It's like attack speed with an asterisk sign, you know? Like, you get attack speed, but only under certain conditions. And I don't want to lose my Equinox value ever. I want to just do damn. By the way, I'm literally just going to be chasing him around. For the remainder of the game, this is what's going to happen. Okay. So I'll probably... So here's the thing. I can either go... Oh, thank you. I can either go Kins right now and just go for kills. Or I can keep being like Omega abusive and get some Fizdy item. Like... I could also just go Shoguns and say fuck it. You know what I mean? Nice. I got that. You're going to knock me up because, you know, why not? Uh, can you get... Oh, man. If you hit it from the back, I can actually give back shots to the totem. With Equinox. That's insane. Um... I mean, him not going Death Toll is... I mean, it's not troll because he's Vamana, so it does make sense. But you have to understand, like, he's never, ever, 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 ever going to be fight. Like, he's never going to fight me. And on top of him never being able to fight me, Susano is never going to come over here. Because if Susano comes over here, I simply get a double kill. That's it. Like, it's actually that dummy simple. Which, it sucks for him. Like, if you're a solo laner, you understand the feeling of knowing, like, oh, man, I'm just going to get owned for a while. And it's a super shitty feeling. But, you know, it is what it is. Hello, Raw. Oh, whatever. I already got the buff. I already got the buff. Look at this, dude. Dude, is this not ridiculous? I mean, I can't see anything, but... My three didn't go off. I got stunned. Wait, how did I get stunned? Oh, was it? It was probably Kumba. Dude, did someone run? We are owning that fight, and everyone just ran away. I don't understand. We were demolishing. I guess Osiris ran away. But, like, we were owning. We definitely should have WT'd. Um, I'll probably just go Thorns here. Uh, let's see... What's my defense item? I think I'll, I'm just going to go Shogun's. I'm just going to keep it simple. You know what they say. 
know what they say. Keep it simple, stupid. Good old kiss. Now, let's see. I am probably behind now because of that whole scenario. 7,100 gold for him. I'm 7,700 gold. He has a kill and he's that far behind. Holy shit. Alright, I'm fine with this. I don't have to check my blue because I know he did it. Never seen a salamander achieve so much. Let alone. Oh, thank you. You are an inspiration to us all. Oh, thank you. Thank you. That's so nice. Thank you so much, man. Alright. I'm coming. Jeez. Whatever, I guess it was their alts. I guess it was their alts. Does he not have TP? If he doesn't have TP, he loses his tower here. I think. I could be capping. I'm not exactly sure. No, he just lost his tower. Alright. gonna get this wave and yeah me and Vamana are probably like now that he has berserker shield i'm not nervous to of like dying to him or anything but like we can't kill each other so there's no real point in when we run past each other there's no point in like you know slapping him in the ass and saying good job buddy you know we're like we're just at this point we're just gaming we're simply farming me and Vamana are both unkillable the only things we can do now to keep the game entertaining for each other or rotate. On my way. The cold fury. I don't I think that's gonna die before you finish it. Yep. Yep. Um, I actually want the attack speed instead of the lifesteal, or, uh, the attack speed instead of the cooldown, I'm pretty sure. That's why you need Stormseeker give you something to do, bro. Do not disrespect me by mentioning that item. Drop a ward here. Drop a ward here. All attack middle lane. Thank you. Not bad. Not bad. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my god, dude. Are we not just demolishing? I'll attack the gold fury. Are we not just owning everything? You should just let me tank because I take no damage. Look at my HP. Look, I'm healing. I'm healing. Bro. I'm just sitting there becoming infinite. Let's Jesus, man. Grab that. Teleport left. Now I have Frostbound. Your middle tower is under attack. Bro, look at my gold. 10,900 as opposed to the Vamana's 9,000. I think Vamana's in mid. Oh no, I found him. 
Hello. I don't even have... I don't have Death's Embrace. I don't have Death's Embrace yet either. By the way, I know everyone's coming over to me. Uh, I could not give any less of a shit. I am not scared. Okay, there's there's actually I didn't expect the last one. I didn't I didn't expect the Kumba. I expected all of the other ones, not the Kumba. Dude, I was owning them. Oh, get him. Get him, buddy. Man, once I get Kins or Death's Embrace, this is just stupidly easy. Should have given a shit? I actually don't think so. For one, I'm not on a killing spree, so my life is kind of meaningless. So why not go for the 1v3? Uh, technically the 1v4. I assumed it was a 1v3 that I would have won, but it was a 1v4 that I lost. Um, And then... And then also, like... We lose almost nothing. Your enemy. I mean, we lost stuff because people rotated for me. But if they just let me fuck around, I'm not worth much gold. Because I'm not on a killing spree. And, um... Hit me. Oh. Oh. I'm not worth much gold because I'm, I'm not on a killing spree. And the upside, the potential of it, is massive. His blue is spawning. Oh, I'm in. Um. Not bad. Oh, they're all in right. They're all in right, dude. God, I was fucking owned. Hello. Hello. Slowed. I got frostbound. Nice. Oh, they're going mid. This is so rude. <laughs> oh. Dude, it's so great. I'm having so much fun. Like, don't get me wrong. This is not, this is not optimal gameplay, but like, you gotta admit, this shit is ridiculously stupid. You know, it's ridiculously dumb. Also, I get Death's Embrace now. <laughs> Because they're going to do gold, and then when they get gold, I should be level 20.
Come on. Come on. Here we go. Nice. I'm gonna defend left lane. Hello. I have Destin Brace now. I'm even harder to kill. Yippee. Observation is the key to victory. I might just push up left lane. Might just be pushing up left lane here. How much do I have to pay you to throw? Are you on the enemy team? Oh god, still is dead. Oh! <gasps> Wait, she's the best. Alright. Wait, did I just hear? I think I just heard someone. them to drop a ward somewhere. Okay. Okay. We have no ward down. You know what I can do though, actually? I'll drop a ward my, for myself right here. Drop a ward for myself. Be back in. Attack, attack. I'll attack. I'll attack. attack. Nice. All right. A little flank. A little flank. All right. I guess we couldn't do that. We couldn't do that because Cherno was being owned. He's being owned in the background. That's okay, though. No worries. No worries. Okay, so now I have kins. So now I'm just going to shred. Like now, I don't think that much can kill me, to be honest. Other than like 11 of them at once. Equinox good. Uh, no, it's great. All right, I literally take no damage. I literally take no damage. On my way. This is so dumb. I need him to win so we can queue together. All right, $1,000 right now, I'll leave the game. 
A thousand dollar dodo right now. I'll leave the game. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Good gracious goodness. Holy. Dude, I just. I just. I hit him 10 times for like. <laughs> I hit him 10 times. A tank for like 1,500 damage, bro. That'd be insane. Oh my God. That's crazy. That's, that's crazy, bro. Anyways. Bologna, baby. Thank you guys so much for watching that. If you actually did enjoy that whole compilation of Conquest games, I would really appreciate it if you gave... A like on this video and subscribe down below if not i understand but uh thank you guys so much for watching and until next time y'all peace